FDC President Colonel Dr. Kizo Besije last night arrived safely in the Kenyan capital, Nairobi, and is now being closely monitored at Nairobi Hospital. Besije landed at the Jomo Kenyatta International Airport shortly after 9 p.m. following a 45-minute flight from Entebbe and was received in Nairobi by the hospital staff. The visibly ailing FDC leader who was clearly in pain was bombarded by journalists whom AAR medical staff were at pains to restrain. One AAR official was nearly lynched by the journalists, each of whom wanted to know the condition of Dr. Besiji. Pan, what are you hiding? Excuse me, sir. This is a leader. What do you have to say? Ah, your mother just. I don't want to put the picture to play for you. What do you have to say? How are you feeling? He has nothing to say. He has nothing to say. Keep away. How are you feeling, sir? The condition. The FDC leader was quickly transferred into the airport's waiting area and driven to Nairobi Hospital. Besija will be treated and further investigations done on the condition of his eyes that were affected by the excessive tear gas sprayed on him during Thursday's standoff. Dr. Besija was last night flown out of the country an hour late after security operatives initially blocked his flight. FDC Women's League leader Ingrid Turinawe told NTV that it took the intervention of the American and British diplomatic missions to convince security operatives to clear Besige to fly. Isabel Nakiria, NTV at One.